my name is Rosie if you're new here and I am back with another day in the life vlog but this one is gonna be all about our dog we have a golden retriever he's almost three in January and I remember I did this video a couple years back and I was like literally no one's gonna watch this video and it's our most viewed video on our channel which still confuses me I don't really know I also get we get like a lot of unsolicited dog parent advice on there this morning I'll give you a little catch-up before I go inside is that we got up at like 6 30 dodge and i always like snuggle in bed when we first get up and then i had to work on a vlog and then i went to a bar class it was super fun i actually accidentally signed up for the harder version of the class so don't know why i did that uh, it was very hard and then i went to trader joe's and then had to run an errand and then i am now home it's 10 o'clock i'm gonna unload my stuff and then we're gonna take the dog on a walk Where is he? Oh, hi, buddy. Oh, are you sleeping? Are you sleeping, bud? Hi. Oh, big stretch. Big stretch. Hi, Dodge. How are you? Oh, thank you for the grunt. Hi. You're beautiful. You want to go for a walk soon? I'm going to unload my stuff. Pause down. Okay, I need to unload this stuff from Trader Joe's really quick. I didn't get anything too crazy. I'll do a haul though, because I feel like everyone always wants to know what we got from Trader Joe's. Rapid fire, what I got from Trader Joe's. For the meats, for the cheese board, I got like a turkey sausage and then this like spicy meat one. Haven't tried to get excited about it. I got these because I know Ryan would really like them and I think I'm gonna make them for him tomorrow. I've always wanted to try this, so I got it. Um, the cheeses I got, so I got this Toscano cheese was dusted with cinnamon. Heard great things about it, as well as this goat cheese that has some fruit on it. And then for the other cheese, I got a burrata. And I actually did stop at a store and get Gouda too, because I didn't, I don't know what we're gonna want. For like the sauces and the dips, I got pepper jelly and this um, mustard, as well as a pesto. Gonna let the dog go run around for a second. Okay, then for the fruits, I got grapes and a pomegranate that I'm gonna peel later. For the crackers, I got pita chips. These, honestly, I like the multi-green ones better than the normal ones. And then we got these pumpkin cranberry crisps. They're seasonal, heard great things again. Candied pecans because it's a necessity on all of my cheese boards, I love them. I got us two Go Macro bars because I love them. Um, I got myself this green smoothie because I want it for later today. Picked up some dark chocolate pretzels, more pumpkin bread because I'm obsessed with it some pumpkin pie spice, and I picked these up, these s'mores treats. They're really not good. Hey, man. Do you think it's a day to listen to folklore? I think so. Me too. I put on his like rope um, leash because recently I feel like he's been kind of like falling out of his um, routine of healing. So we took Dodge to training. Um, and so I know that people will like have questions about his pinch collar um, and or criticism against it. Uh, this is what our trainer told us to do for his breed it doesn't hurt him. We actually really never even have to correct him anymore. So we taught Dodger how to heal, so he should stay by our side. But with his leash on recently, like his Carhartt one that we bought him, he has just kind of been falling out of that. Oh, nice yawn. And so I put his like old rope leash from training back on and he does a lot better and it gives us a little bit more room for me to like help teach him how to heal and make sure that he's staying doing that. So, yeah, that is what we are up to now. And we normally just walk in our neighborhood, but I am just getting bored of walking in the same area over and over and over again. So I decided I'm actually going to take him um, up to a neighborhood called Paramount. And we're gonna walk around there, check out what it looks like, see what the fall trees, just change up the scenery. Um, I'm not doing a ton of work today because it's just already been a busy day, but I just wanna take him out and like get in a nice like 40 minute walk to an hour 
and then I think we're gonna stop and get a little treat. Dodgers days are pretty chill. I'll give like a little quick overview. I work from home. I'm self-employed if you're new here. Um, I'm a photographer. Um, I specialize in weddings, engagements, and boudoir photography. Photography, I just, I just feel like I said that really weird. Our photography. Also, Dodger does not sit in the car. He paces and is frantic. It's, a, it's anxiety, excitement, um, but we don't know what to do to stop. We've tried CBD with him. We've tried melatonin. We've tried Benadryl. We've tried just like taking him on runs before the car and it's the same reaction every time. And I don't really like to give him CBD, melatonin, or Benadryl anymore because I feel like he fights it and um, almost makes the situation worse. So this is what we deal with in the car. It just is what it is. I'm, I'm used to it at this point. We took him in a car literally since he was the day we got him at eight weeks or seven weeks. And yeah, this is just who he is. Our day to day is pretty simple. Like I'm home with him all day. Um, at most throughout the day, he maybe will be alone at home for like two, maybe three hours for errands. We don't actually kennel him anymore. He does still know how to be kenneled. He does still have those skills. Like if we take him to other people's houses, he can still be in a kennel. But at our house now, he just chills and he is able, we shut some doors, but pretty much he just either lays on the couch like you guys saw earlier, lays on the landing by the stairs, or he lays up on our bed. That's pretty much it. We go on walks in the day, go to the park, just a bunch of different stuff, keep him active. He's honestly a really chill dog with me. I would say I'm his alpha just because I'm home with him all day. If I'm chilling, working, he's chilling with me. He sleeps a lot, he chills a lot. He goes outside and lays in the grass, goes and barks at dogs. He's a very chill dog. I love him so much and he's truly like my child. So we're gonna get out and go on a nice little walk today. I'm excited, it's beautiful. Finally fall in Boise. So we live in the Boise, Idaho area. We love it here. We ended up stopping and saying hi to my sister because we ended up being in the same neighborhood that she lives in and then um, decided to stop by and say hi to Ryan or Ryan actually came out and met us and said hi for a couple minutes just to say break up his day and do something nice for him. So now we're going to go to Dutch Bros. Again, I'm not a big Dutch Bros guy but um, our wedding photographer Kylie and friend she, her husband works for Dutch Bros and she told me a drink to get, but she was like, I think you'll like it. So I'm going, I'm doing it. I'm just really not a fan. I know, I literally was talking to Kylie about this too. Like I know it's their job to be social and to be like very friendly, but sometimes it just really overwhelms the crap out of me at Dutch Bros. So I just like, kind of wish they could just like, just give me my drink. It's just a lot sometimes. It sounds like such a complaining, dumb thing, but it just bothers me. Okay. I'm going, I think it's, okay, so I think the drink order is a cold brew, Dodger, a cold brew with pumpkin soft top. I also have so much anxiety when I go to places like this because I hate ordering things new and like nervous that I'm gonna get them wrong. Also, I'm so dumb, it's freaking lunchtime. This is gonna be a mess here, huh? Hi, back up. Can I just do a cold brew with the pumpkin soft top? You got it. Just a plain cold drink, no cream, nothing. Yep. Just plain. And are we doing any Yes, please. Yeah, doing anything fun today? Nope, just putting on a walk. Oh, nice. <laughs> Thank you. And you're all set. Thank you so much. That's like the personality I want. A Dutch Bros. I love her. Hi. 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 <laughs> Do you want a dog treat? Sure, he'd love one. Dodger, back up. Good job. Thank you. <laughs> He's very in my space. Okay. Yes. So is mine. Like yeah. when I take her on drive, she's across. Yeah. I know he doesn't ever like lay down. I'm like, you'd be a lot more comfortable, I swear, yeah. if you just I'm laid down. Like, Thank you. Awesome. Thank you so much. Okay, Thanks, you too. I'm trying it. It looks good. Honestly, this looks incredible. Mmm. Mm, that's a lot. Okay, I need to drink it. Oh my gosh, that's just straight, straight cream. Okay, cold brew is super good. Oh my gosh, love that. 
because I'm not a big, I just really don't like death bros that much. Okay, let's try this. Mix it around a little bit. I like this. Okay, yeah, this is the dream. Wow, look at me liking Dutch Bros. 18 year old me would just love this stuff. Dodger's currently just kind of grazing on his breakfast and I really don't wanna cramp his style, but I do need to kind of clean the house and cleaning gives him a lot of anxiety. He hates, hates the vacuum. I wish there was something we could really do about it, but like we have to vacuum our house. So I think, I think I'm gonna clean. I think it would make Ryan really happy if he came home to a clean house. And um, I haven't cleaned the bathrooms like in a week. So I'm gonna just quickly do that. Um, I probably won't show you guys that because it might be kind of boring, but I will show you Dodger's reaction to the vacuum. It's the same thing every time. I'm not tormenting him. He, a lot of the times he'll go outside, but a lot of times he just like stays inside and dodges it. Quite the Dodger, might I say. Pro tip for cleaning, um, just set an alarm for how long you wanna clean for. And I don't know, I feel like it motivates me a lot more. So I'm just gonna set an alarm for an hour and get as much done in an hour as I possibly can. So I'm probably gonna vlog so I can get as much done as I can. So see you guys probably when I vacuum. He didn't even come downstairs when I was vacuuming. So that's good, he hates it. Oh my gosh, okay guys, I finished cleaning my whole house in an hour and just finished mopping. Ugh. I'm so happy, everything's clean. I am now gonna go shower. Cleaning just like obviously makes you hot and sweaty. But Ryan and I are gonna take a few like fall photos today so we'll be outside so I need to like wash my hair and like get ready so I'm gonna do that. Also another fear of Dodgers, fear number two. Fear number two for Dodge is that he hates the blow dryer. Oh, see this is when he gets anxious after I clean. He says please pet me. Hi, thank you. Thanks for Dino. Oh my gosh, Dodge. He hates the blow dryer. I don't know what to do. We used to like try to like blow dry him when he was a puppy um, to, you know, not make him run around the house all wet. But he hates it. It scares him. He stands around the corner and like peers at me. Do you want Dino upstairs? Come get him. Okay, go take Dino upstairs. Go. Go upstairs. No, no. We're not going on the couch. Go upstairs. Nice job. This is where Dodge hangs when I get ready. He loves the pillows. Hi, huh, bub? I'm about to start blow drying my hair though, so I'll show you what he does. Okay, I'm gonna grab it. You guys ready to watch this? I literally will open this. Okay, don't even point it at him. He'll just stand here. You're fine. It's okay. See, it's like I wish I could like just show him that it's not a big deal. But like, he's scared of it, so. Yeah, I don't know how to get him to stop doing that. So I'll just finish getting ready and sorry, bud. Dodger. Oh my gosh. Come on, come upstairs. Come on, you're good. Come on, buddy. Good job. Up. Good boy. Okay, now I'm gonna get ready as quickly as possible. Just blow dried my hair. We have family photos tonight for Ryan's family. So once I'm done, I'm gonna hang out with the dog a little more, but he'll just hang right here while I get ready really quick. It's like 40 minutes later and I look like a new person. You know, just perks of hair and makeup being done, which is always nice. My outfit right now is lovely. Um, everything is from Walmart. I'm big on the Walmart trend right now. Okay, I'm gonna go set up something because we want to do some photos in the backyard today. Take Dodge out and go hang. Okay, we're gonna go outside. You so excited? Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. for a little bit because I set up this little scene. I realized I had like no updated headshots of myself and just said screw it, I'm gonna do it. So I did look a lot in this hat and I did like three different outfits. Ryan's gonna come home and we're gonna do some in front of there too and then I think that we'll do some maybe like sitting on our little sectional area. We did some little 
family photos in the backyard. Honestly, the last like three hours have zoomed by for me um, between getting ready and then playing with the dog outside, taking some photos. Um, now it's time to go to the Pipers. We're taking our Christmas photo there today. So yeah, we're dressed in the attire. My, we're doing my dad's birthday dinner. Yes, so it was Randy's birthday yesterday and we are in the appropriate outfits from Tara's requests. Uh, yeah, we're doing it early because normally we wait until like Thanksgiving day and we're all too drunk to take it. Mm -hmm, it's just stressful. Yeah, and our eyes look like shit. Yep, so we're gonna go take some family photos, Dodge. We brought his dinner with us, and then he um, will just play around in the backyard. I'm doing a day in the life of Dodger. Oh, yeah. He's having a great day. He um, definitely approves of us being his parents, so if you guys were ever wondering or doubting it, <coughs> God bless ya. <laughs> see him up there. I don't even know. Hey. Okay, this is Dodger's favorite favorite spot. Hey. You just lay down? Lay down. Do you want to end the vlog there? We can do that. Okay, I'm sorry, but his little paw. It is so sweet. Ending the vlog now. We just got back from Ryan's family's house. We did a little birthday dinner for Ryan's dad and now we're home, it's like 10 o'clock. We are honestly super exhausted. It's been a long day and we decided we're just gonna head to bed. So gonna fill up our waters and head to bed. We've had a good day with Dodge. Pretty chill day, honestly. And if you liked this video, make sure you like it and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. And we'll see you guys next time. Bye. <laughs>